Yeah, I'm just going to be completely honest. This entire series of videos were me, where me talking things, <laughs> words, <clears throat> where I'm talking about the overpopulation crisis. Yeah, it's truth. But at the same time, I'm just using this as a mindless filler video, you know, content thing, because... Well, I, I already said why. Anyway. <clears throat> for the third video regarding the subject matter. <clears throat> in the previous one. I spoke about war being a natural counterbalance To the overpopulation crisis. And a number of uh, supporting points and topics throughout historic referencing <clears throat> and now for another psychological program that at the genetic level is currently being seen affecting both male and females of the human species I yes your interpersonal relationships your ability to go on a date, your ability to give a fuck about the opposite sex. Now, how else is there to say it? A lack of sex drive. The 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 war of the sexes. Y you've turned against your contrasting gender because at the mindless mass level everyone is instinctively programmed to be aware that the overpopulation crisis is a definite fucking thing is a problem and aside from the general malice of not giving a fuck about someone else and wanting to kill them QE or IE Q-E-D-I-E, war, it goes into a much deeper level where you don't want to procreate. You don't want to speak with a member of the opposite sex, have anything to do with them, uh, engage sexually with them or romantically or any type of engagement. Uh, homosexuality arises as a, a counterbalance to an overpopulation crisis. But even further so than just that, it, it, it devolves, is the best way to put it, it devolves from um, a minor twinge in, in the back of the mind into a, a fierce and emotionally fueled rage and hatred for the opposite sex, which portrays itself in many different forms. At, for examples of what's going on, you can look at YouTubers similar to Better Bachelor. Um, well, there was two or three others. Anyway, they're covering the dating scene, but they're they're unaware that what they're covering is the mass symptoms of the overpopulation crisis. They're unaware of what's really going on because they haven't studied more than just this one tiny subject matter. So they know all this big massive mountain fucking Mount Everest sized load of information about bullshit going on in the dating scene and they're, they're sitting there thinking why is this continuing? I want to keep telling people, hey, this is a problem, it needs to stop, but they don't know why it's happening, so they can't address the issue. The actual problem, it isn't the dating scene. Don't go harass those YouTubers, because, because of their ignorance. They know a lot about this particular symptom 
of the actual problem. And yeah, they could suggest solutions to help stabilize that symptom so that it becomes less of an issue, but it is just a symptom. You need to stop focusing on that symptom and you need to focus on the actual problem. The problem being that the human species is overpopulated massively, literally seven billion plus human lives. In the first video in this subject matter I said Well, actually, I titled it Valueless Lives. Yeah, Overpopulation, Crisis, Symptoms, Valueless Lives. It's that, uh, that idea of, you know, there's, there's just so many fish in the sea, why should I give a fuck? It's just another mindless fling, another one-night stand. Yeah, that's the mindset that a lot of male and female have gotten into and that's that's a cyclical symptom that generates this massive amount of animosity that causes you to hate each other which leads to war and it leads to this psycho fuck psychological war of the sexes male versus female and a declining birth rate is what happens from that because male and females get disinterested in sex with each other disinterested in having a relationship with each other disinterested in even being friends with each other because Humanity is in an overpopulation crisis. There's a number of other symptoms that I can address and probably make several more videos on the subject matter. So, to recap this video, it was nothing more than a rant about the overpopulation crisis symptom of male and female interactions just not happening with each other. Sex drive drops out because there's just so many people, why should I give a fuck? Yeah, there's, there's so many useless trash girls out there, so many sluts, why should I care? Well, there's so many guys they are just players. Why the fuck should I care? So they stop giving a fuck. They stop fucking. So the dating scene just goes into complete fucking chaos. Uh, let's see. There's some other bits here. Um, femi feminist versus masculinist. Uh, the reversal of traditional gender roles. Uh, females are just genetically programmed and meant to be controlled. None of them are ever supposed to be in a position of power. That's just the way things are at the genetic fucking level. For every species I've encountered on this planet. Why the fuck are you humans not getting that? And, and for you Christians. Here, I love using your own religion just to fuck with you horribly about it. Uh, is it the book of Proverbs? Proverbs. It was the it was a bit of King Solomon. He said, In all my travels I would encounter one out of every one hundred men who could be said to be intelligent. And one out of every one hundred of those could be truly wise and no women. 
Yeah, Christians, get all pissed off. Show how much hostility you have there. Sh go on, fucking show me. Because all you're doing is proving me right. I, I really do hate all religion. I really do. So I'm just fucking with everyone on that one. Anyway, enough with the psycho fuck hostilities. Just, you know, proving my own point. Enough of me doing that. I need to digress and end this video because I've ranted on about this particular thing long enough. Like, there's a like button, a dislike button, there's a, a, a button somewhere that uh, subscribes you, and there's another button on the opposite side of the top of the thingy, I think, or was it the bottom somewhere? I don't fucking remember where YouTube puts its shit these days. There's a button that turns on your notifications. You'll know when I come out with other shit to laugh at or, or get angry at. I don't fucking care which probably somewhere in between as well probably and there's links in the description yeah down there links in the description that'll let you uh, pick whatever flavor of supporting me financially with um, my drug addiction to alcoholism and caffeine so that I can get really drunk and do dumb shit and you can tell me shut up take my money do dumb shit while you're drunk so I can laugh at it there I, there's all those things if you give a fuck for those things either way until next time fuck off